we were talking about solving quadratic equations and there are a number of methods that you can use to solve a quadratic equation. The first method is you can use graphing that will sometimes work. You only want to use that if an exact answer is not required. Better if you check your work to make sure that you're in the right place, but not really reliable to get an exact answer most of the time. Factoring, that will sometimes work. It works really well if the C value is zero or if you can pick up the factors really easily. So on the right there, there's x squared minus 7x. There's no C value, so that one you could factor an x out very quickly. The square root property, that also sometimes works. Uh, you get to use that when the equation in, in which one side of the equation is a perfect square. So on the left side there, we have x minus 5 squared. That is a perfect square. We could start solving that by taking the square root of both sides. And that would help us find our solution. Those first three examples, those only sometimes work. Completing the square, uh, that always works. It's useful for equations in the form x squared plus bx plus c, where b is even. Doesn't It does work for odd function, for odd b values, but then you end up with uh, a decimal, and it's a little bit more tricky to work with. The quadratic formula is the most reliable and most consistent. It, it works with anything. Uh, and if you can't figure out graphing, factoring, square root, or complete the square, uh, I recommend that you use the quadratic formula as, a, as always a go-to.